What is going on, everybody? So check this out. This is this this is the situation, and I want y'all opinion on this one. So this chick wants me to give her some money for she can leave her her area. She's she's never have left her her village. So I'm like, all right, cool. You want to come to Tijuana? You know, I'll show you the city life out here. And pretty much I'll pay for your ticket. So she was just like, okay, cool. I'm like, all right. But she wants the money. I'm like, nah, I'm not about to do that. If you want to come out here, I'll pay for the ticket, you know, and let you enjoy the, the lifestyle, the city lifestyle out here in, T in Tijuana. You know, kind of doing her a favor because I know she ain't never, you know, um, been out of her her area before in her life so i feel like i'm doing a good deed so she continuously asking me like just send just send me the money and i'll get the ticket i'm like this sounds fishy i'm not booba the fool yo no soy tonto <laughs> so i told her like look if if you want to come it's like this i'll get you the ticket just pass me on information and i'll get that taken care of so she goes non-responsive for a while. I'm like, all right, cool. Not a problem. So she was just like, you know what? I don't want to go, you know, forget it, this and that. I'm like, okay, that's a red flag. So I'm like, that wasn't her intentions anyway. So I'm just laughing about it. And I just let the situation go. The next minute, oh, yeah, necesito dinero, por favor, ayúdame. I'm like, come on, man. Like, what's the real situation behind this? So she told me and switched up the story. Like, okay, look, my cousin is in jail, mi primo, and I need money to help him get out of jail. And pretty much that's the situation why I need money. And after that, I'll go to Tijuana. You got me fucked up. Like, come on, man. Like, for for one. I'm not boo I'm not boo the fool. I don't mind um showing a person around and going out, going out my way and helping him, but I ain't about to bail out another dude out of jail, you know, <laughs> especially, you know, if I don't know the stories and details behind that and way. That's that's just me. Like I said, if if I'm gonna have to spend my, my money, you gotta give me that story, you know, and you gotta be up front with me. But nah, I don't get down like that. I'm not about to just, you know, hand her hand her cash to get this next dude out of jail. And I, I, I know this girl. I've seen this girl in person before. So it's a little different. But I ain't kicked it with her like that. And uh, again, I, I haven't spent time with her like that. You know, we're we're just cool. We're cool peoples. So I'm like, nah, hell nah. That's a no go. <laughs> it's, not, it's, a, it's, a, it's a done deal. So I'm like, look. You can look for a lot of other dudes out uh, out there. You know, you're a pretty you a pretty girl, and a lot of dudes should give you money out there in your little pueblo, in your little village, or whatnot. So I'm like, look, to me, I'm not giving out no money. End the story, be gone, and that's just what that's that that's just what it is. So I mean, yes, yeah, she looks at me as an American. So you know, last uh, worst case scenario. Um, I know I can hit him up because I know he's really nice and this and that. Look, don't take advantage of my niceness. <laughs> like, I know when to pump the brakes. But again, I will go out my way to help help people if I really can see if they really need that help or whatnot. But man, I ain't about to bail out another dude out of jail, you know. And I don't know if that's her 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 cousin in quotation marks. But my instinct is like, hell, not that ain't her cousin. Like, man. That could be your boyfriend or whatever. And what the hell does that look like? Me bailing out another dude and we ain't even kicked it like that. Like, nah, it ain't happening. So, um, again, me being an American, and I, I know a lot of um, other people had these same ex same experiences when, you know, they're um, seeing these other out, out of the country girls or they have... Um, dates and things like that that they never seen them in person they just kind of you know know them by um facebook or these other dating services but uh, again the whole point is that you know these 
these women, they ask for a bunch of money from us Americans, but because they think we rich like that. And um, they they just think we're made out of gold and they just think it's easy for them to just get money from us a lot like that without knowing the situation behind it. So I don't know. What do you guys think about that? Um, do you think that it was her her cousin that really needed the money to get out of jail or that was, you know, her boo on the side or things like that. But at the end of the day, I don't care what that situation was. My instinct is pretty much like, fuck that. I ain't coughing up no money to get no other dude out of, out of jail, especially a dude I don't know, even if they connected to a chick I know. That's just me. Hey, I'm sorry. I'm just calling it what it is. I'm calling it how I see it. What do you guys think about that situation? Let me know.